Hong Kong's new spot Bitcoin and Ether ETF see $11.2 million in trading volume on debut day. Hassan Shidu last updated. May 1, 2024 at 206 GMT plus 32 minute read. Hong Kong's entry into the spot Bitcoin and Ether exchange traded funds F's market saw six newly introduced ETFs record a trading volume of $87.5 million, $11.2 million on their first day of trading. The figure falls extremely short of the $4.6 billion achieved by the 11 spot Bitcoin ETFs in the United States. These new Hong Kong Bitcoin ETFs are managed by China Asset Management Harvest, Global, Bozera, and Hashkey. Hong Kong Bitcoin ETFs disappoint. The launch of Hong Kong Bitcoin ETFs follows the rising investor interest in virtual asset ETFs since the introduction of VA Futures ETFs in late 2022, with an average daily turnover for VA Futures ETFs surging to $51.3 million in Cone 2024. These ETFs attracted $529 million in net inflows. Despite the anticipation surrounding their launch, the trading volumes for these ETFs were relatively low compared to their counterparts in the U.S. According to HGEX data, the China Asset Management China AMC Bitcoin ETF had the biggest trading volume, securing $37.16 million on the first day. Its Ether ETF trailed behind with $12.66 million in volume. Other ETFs, such as the Bozer Hashkey Bitcoin ETF and the Bozer Hashkey Ether, F saw lower trading volumes, highlighting a subdued market response to the new offerings. Commenting on the trading volumes, Justin Danathan, head of APAC Business Development at Kirok, acknowledged the lower figures compared to the U.S. launch but emphasized the positive aspect of decent buy-in considering Hong Kong's market dynamics. While it's easy to have overblown expectations, bound to fall short, I actually think the spot ETFs and HK are a success, no near comparable to the launch of spot BTC ETFs in the US, but it's happening in a very different market dynamic, said Danathan. He noted that while the volumes didn't match those of the US, it's a major step forward for the region. The fact that Hong Kong, which doesn't offer access to mainland China investors, it's worth remembering is getting some decent buying is positive, he said. The lackluster debut of the Hong Kong ETFs coincided with a broader downturn in the cryptocurrency market, with Bitcoin's price dipping below $60,000. The disappointment in the Hong Kong Bitcoin ETF launch and Bitcoin's price decline reflects a cautious sentiment among investors amid market turbulence. Despite the setback, industry experts are optimistic about the long-term prospects of cryptocurrency ETFs in Hong Kong. Hong Kong spot ETF's launch was projected to $300 million first day inflow. Hong Kong's inaugural Bitcoin ETFs have attracted considerable anticipation from issuers with a projected combined first day inflow of around $300 million. Despite Bloomberg Intelligence's Rebecca Sin's cautious estimate that Bitcoin and Ether funds could accumulate around $1 billion in Hong Kong over the next two years, Han Tong Lee, CEO of Harvest Global, expresses confidence in surpassing this estimate. He emphasizes the appeal of Hong Kong's financial products and services which cater to investors in the West and the East in contrast to the primarily Western-focused offerings in the U.S. Potential sources of demand for Hong Kong spot crypto ETFs include Chinese wealth invested in the city and Asia-Pacific crypto exchanges and market makers. While the U.S. Bitcoin funds have attracted global attention, prospective Hong Kong issuers, such as Harvest Global Investments Limited and Hashkey Capital Limited, in partnership with Bozer Asset Management International Company, may need help achieving the same recognition level. The successful launch of ETFs in Hong Kong signals a growing interest in digital assets, albeit with initial challenges in trading volume and market volatility. Interest will likely surge in the coming months, and investor sentiment will subside once Bitcoin starts performing well again. Follow us on Google News.